What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is RaiseDox and today I want to talk about the new update that is currently in the test server for us to try out. Now this update is adding a lot to the game so let's go ahead and get started. To start off there was a massive bunker that was added to the northeastern part of the map for us to explore. Now I was able to go into the test server and actually explore this bunker myself and I can assure you that it is a massive area to cover. So if you plan on going to this bunker make sure that you have some kind of teammate with you or take the necessary weapons to defend yourself. Once you're inside the bunker you will come across several locked boxes that require a special key. These keys can only be found on military NPCs and after the hour that I spent trying to look for one and killing dozens of NPCs myself, I can assure you that they're rare to find. Once you're able to open these boxes within the bunker, you will find weapons with camo and other valuable loot. You're also going to need to pay attention because this bunker is a new mission area and if you're inside the bunker and a mission spawns, you will get yourself trapped. Moving on to the next part of the update, if you guys were experiencing any glitching or lag within the inventory menu, those things have now been fixed. Apart from the massive bunker that was added to the game, you can also expect to find a mobile trader throughout the map. Now these mobile traders are marked with a special icon and you have a limited amount of time to get to them and trade for better loot. If you don't have anything to sell them, you can simply just take cash and buy whatever you want. I am excited to see these traders come to the game due to the fact that players will have different ways to get their loot. So for example, if a player decides that he just wants to build a base and lay low and not get into any kind of fights, they can simply just wait for the traders to appear, quickly get to the location and trade for items. Continuing on with the update, they added two shortcuts that will come in handy. The first shortcut is the ability to pick up items quicker from the ground. So instead of dragging it over to your inventory, all you have to simply do now is shift and right click. For the second shortcut, you're able to drop items directly from your inventory to the ground without dragging it. And to do this, you simply just hold down left alt and press right click. Now apart from everything that I already mentioned, they did have some smaller fixes that were made to the game. Within these smaller changes, they added that traders will no longer be able to sell you walkie talkies or flashlights, but instead they will purchase them from you at a higher price. Another change that is coming to the game is that you will no longer be able to build a base on top of the lighthouse and it will be impossible to build a base inside the bunker. Now questions did come up throughout the community if there will be another wipe in the future due to the fact that people already build bases on top of the lighthouse. Now I was able to see a response from one of the discord community managers stating that a wipe was coming but it's unsure how it's going to be. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Now I didn't mention all of the small fixes that were made to the game just to make sure this video wasn't too long. So if you want to check out the entire patch notes, please check the description box where I left you a link to follow. If you found this information helpful, please make sure to smack the thumbs up button and also subscribe to the channel so that you can keep up with Deadside's development. Alright guys, so without further ado, I appreciate you watching and I'll see you on the next video.